Hey y'all, this is Crookalicious checking in for another episode of Bell Imperii, and last time we joined the Roman Empire, and that means we are officially a vassal, so actually let's take a quick look at if we have anything. Alright, we do have a quest, so we might want to uh, get that one all squared away. We, we got, I don't know if we got enough time, guys. I just don't. 117 days. Ah, uh, yeah, you know, you know how it goes. Um, but anyways, let's go into the factions real quick. Um, Roman Empire, then right there, Marcus Maris Crucilicious. Okay, they gave us Lord of Alluvium. <laughs> I pronounced that wrong. So kids, don't quote me. Alright, so it's up here. It's been raided. Great. Love raided. Love raided settlements. And little towns, I should say more so. Did anything else? Okay, let's come back in here and let's see our relations with everything else. No, I'm not saying issue with Dacia. We're at war. Um, no, I'm not saying issue. We're at war with this faction too. Um, and this faction. Truce. No issue. No issue. Scott the Eye. War. Mark Manny. Recent. Frizzy. Alright, so we're at war with a few different factions. Um, and the one thing that's cool about this mod, too, is just the amount of uh, factions there really are. I mean, if you look at Legal, um, in comparison, there is not as many factions. And so that's, this is a cool part of all that. So, anyways, let's see here. Are we at war with this faction? Who Who is this one? Yeah, we're at war with that one. Um, the Swaby, I don't think we're at War with Swaby, which is, which is good, because that would be a problem. Mark of Manny, we are. So basically, if we ever want to get up to the Swaby, we have to go through one or the other, in essence. Um, not good. Uh, Burgundies, I can't remember. I don't think we were at war with them. And I think this is Dacia over here. Yeah, it's Dacia. Um, Sarmanthia. And who's this up here? All by them lonesome. ISD or something like that. Um, and then Frizzy and then the Scotty. I'm guessing. Nope. Calimony and then who's this? That's the Scotty. And that's the that one other faction as well. So we're at war with a few different factions, guys. It should be pretty interesting. I keep forgetting that this is not total war. You can't use those keys in order to turn those directions anyways let's uh see what else we need to do right now we are full to the brim um so let's level up everybody real quick then and what was the skirmishers noble skirmishers so we need to get skirmishers in that's always the best way and i completely forgot again because it's been a few weeks since i've been recording this series um i forgot to update the names of the individuals so forgive me once again guys um, hold me to it by next week. I will definitely have that done. Okay, let's get a Roman Levy. Oh, let's put you in the Legionnaires. Okay. Okay, we're above average morale. We got 14 prisoners. I doubt there's a ransom broker in here, but we'll always look. Never mind. Don't quote me, guys. I'm telling you, don't quote me. <laughs> okay, we'll get some money for these guys. Perfect. Perfect, perfect, perfect. Okay, uh, I don't think there's a whole lot of, whole much else we need right here. Um, I might head south a little bit. Oh, cool, we get to put one of our flags in. Um, so regardless of what I'm going to do here, I might actually just go with my own personal flag, my own personal banner. Um, but for the time being, I think doing the SPQR is going to be the awesome way to go. Represent the Roman Empire until I change it to um, become Crocalicious. Now you can tell some of these are actually a little bit off. Um, and that's all due to the, the programming and stuff. Well, not the programming, the, the way the image file was laid out. So anyways, cool stuff. We got ourselves a new banner, which is great. Wishes to join you. We're going to be probably the cattle herders. Um, that's usually how it goes in those ones. But in order to build relations, we have to go talk to him. He was near Ravenna, last reported. So he's up in the north. Alright, let's start heading north then. Okay, let's uh, go quickly. Quickly now, quickly. 
Oh, my banner is off. Hey, watch. Oh, that's sad. Yeah, that's one minor bug, I'll have to say. And it's really just a matter of positioning. Um, it was probably just a little mistake right there when these were added. That's okay. Okay, so we're going out to Ravenna. Watch, he's probably gone from Ravenna by now. Um, that's usually how it goes in my experience. Okay, one day old. Let's go to Ravenna. We might actually have some money. Do we even have any land here? I thought we bought land here. Um, can't quite remember, actually. Okay, let's check the meat hall. We got Traveler in here. Cavern, a tavern keeper, not cavern keeper. I mean, that'd be pretty funny still, but. Okay, do we have enough food to last us the winter? Okay, we can get rid of the fighting axe. Let's get a little bit more food. There we go. Uh, well. We are cheap in this company. Okay, um, so Ravenna is in the field near here, which could be anywhere, honestly. Okay, okay, okay. Let's do this. Where are you at, dude? Wait, who am I even looking for, anyways? Let's uh, let's do that. Like, got this, Helvius, Portinax. Uh, I doubt the at the X is actually pronounced in Latin, anyways. Actually, they didn't even have a letter J in Latin. And I know a lot of people may be thinking, like, Julius Caesar. And it's like, yeah, it's actually an I for the start of his name. Just a little tidbit. At least that's what I learned in high school when I was taking Latin for two years. So, <laughs> And also, V's were pronounced with, like, a W noise more so. I don't know if that's historically accurate. I mean, you're talking about a language that's been dead for, um, I mean carried on by the Catholic Church, but I mean, it probably changed with, even within the Catholic Church. So, uh, let's see here. A lord of a fief you can now appoint, a chamberlain who resides at your court, uh, it's been, it's supposed to be your court, for a weekly salary of 15 coins, he will handle all financial affairs. By collecting, collecting and determining taxes, paying wages, and managing your estate. In addition, he supervises money transfers between kingdoms, giving you more diplomatic options. We're going to proceed without a chamberlain for right now. Alright, I want to fight somebody, and I'm sick of just wandering around. Quest cancelled. Alright, well, oh, that, was, that was quick. And that was lame, too, because we could have been actually going somewhere and actually doing something, but instead we were running around trying to find somebody who decided to cancel our trip. Ah. Oh, trip counselors. Okay. Not counselor, but cancel... Yeah, you, you guys know what I mean. <laughs> okay. Let's come up here. Let's put infantry up in front. Let's uh, grab my legionaries, put them right behind, archers right there, and cavalry off in the flanks. I think they're coming. Yeah, they're, they're coming. They're definitely coming. Okay, let's join the front line. Oh, that's so sad about the image, guys. I'm going to put my own image in anyway, so not too concerned. Okay, let's uh, pull out our bow and arrow and see if we can have our trusty bow. Nope. <laughs> I don't know if you guys can see that. Sometimes the video quality on YouTube is pretty bad, but it was so short. Okay, let's uh, get a little bit lower. Okay, I think we're gonna get a kill here soon. Nice! Just hold true to right in front of you. Okay. I love how none of them went for the captain. They're probably like, man, he's so OP. Oh. Okay, come on. There we go. 
Yeah, don't don't raise a club to me. What are you thinking, dude? Okay, take this guy out. I love taking out bandits. I think it's so much fun. Alright, cavalry charge in. No, we lost a surf. We lost a surf. We lost somebody, guys. How can that happen? <laughs> okay, we got 39 kills. I personally got 14 of them. I always love doing that. Alright, that, that was fun. That was, that was fun just like, you know, because we haven't done anything this whole episode because we're trying to actually do something. And, of course, nothing happened. So, typical stuff. Okay, um, let's level up everybody then. I think that's good, unless some of these guys can that we can't see off the screen. Which is a very likely possibility, too. Anyways, let's burn and loot their stuff. Okay, that's money, 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 a uh, little bit of money. Okay, not really too much right here. Yeah, whatever. Okay, 44 coins. I like it. We're at 14,000 then. Can we turn off the companion? Okay, I'm gonna actually go check that out real quick. Uh, mod options, tell me you can turn off bickering between um, companions because I think that's the most stupid thing ever in any of these mods. Um, and vanilla even, in fact, too. I mean, I can understand in real life that happened to some degree. I'm not seeing it anymore, guys. Formation mod options. I uh, don't worry about that. Uh, disable battle continuum. Troops. Um, I don't know if we can do that. Um, I think in your lair would be kind of cool. Build your own personal lair. I think that would be cool, but that's 20,000 coins. Something we do not have. Marco Manny and us made peace. Yes. Okay. So that means either we go for Dacia or we go north. Let's recruit some volunteers real quick. I'm going to go north to see if we can go fight a lord or something. You gift the purse to... I love how they have a hospice. I didn't even know if that was a thing back in the Roman Empire, but that would be interesting. Sure. Might as well build up my reputation and stuff and become a good noble man. I wanted the money. I'm just kidding. Not too hard to make money in this game. If you know what you're doing, at least. Cattle is a great way to go about it. Um, destroying bandits is a great way to go about it because, honestly, like, watch this. It's getting milked. Just from that one battle, we made 855 coins. Of course, we lost one unit, so that means we have to account for them a little bit. And a few other things, and also the amount of time we spent. Um, let me check the meat hall, actually, real quick. Um, just in case there is a ransom broker here now, and we're not going to completely miss them. Nope, it looks like there's nobody here except for Roman Surf, which I don't really care to ever have in my army, but they are basically the recruiting unit, and so whatever, we'll, we'll deal with them for the time being then. Okay, let's uh, head north then, and we'll go see if we can get into a little skirmish or something with another lord. So here, um, we're at war with uh, the Chatty and also Dacia. Both of them are across rivers, which makes sense historically that was correct. Um, so let's uh, let's come over here, climb over the mountains. Okay, nothing that we have to pay because I kind of changed the scripts. <laughs> Scrimps. <laughs> Another word for shrimp. Kind of a more of a slang version of it, I think. Okay, we are now in enemies behind enemy lines, and it's evening. Let's be careful then. But I really do want to fight another faction, if at all possible. Let's see, does it show us being like take hostile action? Are we at war with the chatty? Let me let me just make sure we are, because it could be that one of those weird cases where we're not at war with them. Okay, so the Roman Empire, chatty, 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 chatty. Nope, no issues. Okay, 
then it's pointless for me to be over here. Okay, let's go over to Dacia then. Marco Manny, another day. Says we have 58 days left. Man, my Manny too much. Here, let's uh, drop by this town real quick and go see if we can buy supplies. Yeah, okay, that's not a lot, but it's food. It's food. Okay, let's see here. This is Dacia right there. So guys, we're on the front lines now. Ooh, ooh, can we take him on? Wait, are we at war with them? I swear we're at war with them. Am I part of the Roman Empire? Yes, I am a part of the Roman Empire. The Roman Empire is at war with Dacia. The fight has been a war making tea for some time. Alright, well, let's, uh, go fight this guy, then. <laughs> oh, sweet. My name already strikes fear in men's hearts. Wow. Fighting a bunch of bandits. I'm the bandit killer. Yeah! Alright. Men. Oh, this is a great position. Okay, let's uh, put my infantry right there, put my legionnaires right there, and then I'll put my archers right here. And I'll leave my cavalry off to the side, probably this side. Alright, I'm going to have everybody uh, do hold their fire, except for the archers. I will give them the order to fire at will here momentarily, and it's lagging a bit, probably because of the water. Oh, this looks pretty sweet, actually. I love how that guy... Okay, he, he has no arms from this distance, but he has arms when you zoom in. Okay, good. I was a little concerned right there. Okay, let's uh, do fire at will now. Ooh. Okay, let's see if we can get these guys off their horse. Okay, we're taking these guys out. Everyone, fire at will now, please. Okay. Oh, shoot. I put my archers over there. I meant to put my cavalry. Cavalry, go save them. Holy cow. Oh, that was a mistake. Okay, let's go over here. Okay, cavalry charge in now. Okay, let's come in here. Okay, I want to fall back with my cavalry if at all possible because we don't have many of them. Okay, let's drop them over there. All this lagging is frustrating. That's okay. Okay, got those guys taken out. Okay, let's see if we can come over here and take out a few other guys. Okay, got that guy taken out. Okay, let's uh, have cavalry come over here, and we'll have them charge in against all these archers. Okay, cavalry charge in now. It's a lot of archers. Actually, let's just have everybody basically charge in now. Okay, bring it on! Didn't I tell everybody to charge? Yeah, okay, they're charging. Nice! Got that guy taken out pretty good. Oh, we got some routers.
I have no idea where those are landing. I think it's basically impossible now. We're going to have to leave this up to our cavalry. Um, let's see here. Yeah, they're routing in all directions. And most of our cavalry following actually that one guy. Um, all the way in the west, which is quite a shame. But let's look at myself. Yeah, there's Marcus. Oh, good job, sir. His shield has... One, two, three arrows up top and a few more down below. Nice. Good job. Okay, how many men do we lose? We lost 28, which is actually a good amount. 11 wounded. We need to get a medic in our company. A lot of that was actually my bad because I accidentally positioned my men wrong, so uh, that happens, I guess. But Okay, we got one more guy killed. and Yep. That's okay. I don't think we're going to get to these guys, but that's that's fine. There's one more left. Okay. Only nine got away, which I can live with. That's a good number to live with. Uh, so let's continue. Uh, you're my prisoner now. Okay, let's uh, get the very good units if we can. So maybe the noble warriors and fluxmen. Okay. Let's uh, get rid of the looters. Okay, um, anybody who is of high birth, Kevin, or no, um, let's get that guy. Okay, I think that's good. I mean, Artemis just leveled up as well, and so that's awesome. Okay, uh, let's take three hours. Hopefully, we'll be able to get up here alive. Let's move my food up. Okay, and then we'll grab all this stuff, which a lot of it's probably actually pretty decent. I mean, we got to account for us losing all the men we did, but hopefully this doesn't backfire against us. She will be a pretty woman. Okay. Okay, so we got 70 men left, and we're going to get a good amount of money from this. Of course, I don't know if it is good. It's going to be a good thing for us to lose that many men every time, though. But now we can hold up to 103 units, which is great. So, I mean, when you get your renown up, um, honestly, that's, that's the most important thing. is Just keep pushing at it, and you'll actually be able to get to that point. So, anyways, we recruit a few more men right there. Now we're at A1. Okay, I was like, why? I felt like he was just coming right for me. I was getting a little bit nervous, a little bit. Um, so, anyways, I'm gonna go recruit a few more men. Forcible recruitment. This village does not like me. Okay, I see how it is. He goes, he goes like racist, right? Oh, wait, this is even my village. Okay, we need to get a quest for them. Uh, let's meet with a village elder. Um. Our men are angry. We cannot defend ourselves. All right, let's actually do that real quick. I know this is not the most exciting one. We can actually recruit some volunteers too. Train the peasants. Train them. Yes. And then basically, this is what you do. And then you just wait. You wait, and you wait some more. <laughs> nice, and we're using spears. Ooh, nice. nice, good job, guys. Ooh, good hit. Take that, though. Eat that! Okay, anyways, and then you just train the peasants again, and then until some bandits attack you, you just keep training. It's that much going on. Okay, we got three units now. Nice. Oh, gosh. 
Um, I'm not liking these odds. Okay. Not good, not good to have it. I don't, I don't think I'm gonna actually live. <laughs> I wonder what happens when that happens. I actually haven't been beaten. Oh gosh, that's actually really funny. I got taken out. Um, but I mean, half the time in the other mods, they they don't have spears. So we need to. Uh, I guess this could be good practice for me. I can't just keep giving that much damage and expect to be okay. Ooh, that was a good hit, but nice. Took one of them out. Shoot. Oh, shoot. Hey, more hit. Dang it. Oh my gosh. I hate how they have spears. Come on. Alright, I need to make it where... Because until I beat them, I don't think you can actually... Uh, <laughs> fight the... The bandits. Okay, so it takes pretty much three good hits. Okay, let's keep training them. This is going to take a little bit of time, but it's good to build up relation in my own village. Come on, guys. Come on. Kill me, Smiles. Alright, there's three of them again, so I'm going to try to use trees and other things and run away. There we go. That's more like it. And of course. Not good. Okay, got one out. Okay, got a good, good hit on that guy. Okay, got that guy out. I think now I can actually beat this guy. Yeah! Strategy worked! There we go. Alright, here they are. Here they are. The bandits are coming. The bandits are coming. The bandits are coming. Okay, let's uh, do this. Infantry up front. Legionnaires behind them. Archers right here. Everyone, hold your fire except archers. You fire at will. Oh, wow. All right, um, all right, everyone now fire at will. Okay, I got a bow and arrow now, so. Let's uh, start shooting in here if at all possible. Got that guy taken out. I don't want to hit my own men. Oh, gosh darn it. Okay, this is frustrating. Nice, headshot. I love how headshots are like one-shot kills. Okay, headshot. keep missing right there come on I was getting a little focused right there because I was like this is actually kind of fun you know it's like target practice well it is very much target practice and of course friendly shot right there all right everybody charge in let's just take these two out I'm gonna go take this guy out so he doesn't take out my one unit that I accidentally hit it. there we go Victorious. Okay, and I got seven kills. I moved to the great guy for you too. 
Okay, let's uh, do this one. And now they really like me. Yay! And just like that, I can recruit some more men for them. All right. Sweet. Well, anyways, guys, I'm going to actually leave it here. Um, hopefully you guys have enjoyed. Um, we have a good amount of things going for us. And we can actually hold up to 108. And then I need to level up everybody. I need to change the names of all the companions to actually match the ones that have been requested. And I'll see you guys next time. This is Corporal Issues. Check it out.